there'll be a wide range of views here. But really now, we have to take sides on the constitutional question. Because the situation has now gone so far. The problems in the British state, now so deep, now so dangerous, that if we do not mobilise for independence now, then we're never going to be able to do it. And if we don't do it now, we are not going to be able to send the message, not just to people right across our own country in Scotland, but to people in England, every single person in England who wants a better future. Then we need to link arms with them, but we need to say at the same time that the UK isn't working. Look at the news today. The whole system is beginning to fracture apart. And in that, it means there's a real crisis, a real social crisis. There's going to be a big economic crisis. There's going to be a recession. When that happens, there's only one force that's going to prevent that leading to further division, to further hatred. And that's going to have to be each and every one of us coming together and building, building a movement, building a movement that can bring together all of the people that we need to from below start to think about how we can challenge this system. So I'll end just by saying, let's not let the right off the hook with any of this. When the economic crisis that's going to happen now, the recession is going to come, we have to make sure that there's not an entrenchment of blame and displacement of blame on immigrants. And lastly, we now are in such a serious situation that the firing gun, in my view, for independence started today. Yeah. Yeah! 